The rain from last week is adding up in communities across central Indiana. Tonight, an entire park is flooded from today's weather alone, and neighbors are worried what will happen to their homes this weekend. RTV6's Melissa Mahadeo joins us live at the Arbuckle Acres Park now with the very latest. Yeah, Erica, this park unfortunately is not very well lit. We've done the best we could. Hopefully you can see those water levels behind me. If you can make them out, they've pretty much stayed around the same spot since we first got out here several hours ago. Thankfully, the rain has slowed, so it hasn't made it worse. Unfortunately, though, it hasn't really receded or moved in these past few hours. Now, earlier today, several people coming out here just to take a look at this and take it all in. We actually spoke with one of the park's employees. He was one of the people who came out here to got to get a look at this park. Now he tells me that he and several other people actually started preparing for these floods around eight this morning. They noticed those water levels starting to rise, so they came out here to this park, took the trash cans out, also took the tables out so that nothing would start to kind of wash away as the water levels started to rise. You can see how far it started to rise. A lot of people we spoke with overall surprised to see that this park could be covered in several inches of water. I just came over to walk my dog. <laughs> so you and surprise. Walk. We're from Florida. We've only been here a while ourselves. And when they say two inches of rain causes flooding, we laughed. And now we know why. <laughs> Now, the park employee also told me that their understanding is this is likely a, an accumulation of the week's worth of rain, not just today's. Of course, we're going to continue to monitor these. Thankfully, we were notified about this because someone sent this into us. So as of right now, the good news is it hasn't gotten any worse. But to be quite honest, the water has not receded from this park for right now. Reporting in Brownsburg, I'm Melissa Mahadeo, RTV6 News. And we also want to point out Hamilton County is under a flood warning tonight and is making sure your family stay safe in the weather. Sandbags will be available for anyone from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. tomorrow. All you have to do is go to 1717 Pleasant Street in Noblesville and prove you're a Hamilton County resident.